Gator Dust is a unique product designed specifically for natural stone for use in patios and walkways. It is a polymeric stone dust and can make joints up to 4 inch in inches in width. Using Gator Dust will inhibit weeds, insects and erosion from wind and rain. It has excellent resistance to freeze thaw cycles. Gator Dust installs dry like a polymeric sand. Sweep it into the joints, clean it off, mist it and you're done. In the first part of this video, we're going to show you how to repair an existing installation. See how weeds growing in this existing joints detract from the beauty of the stone. This is how the joints will look after we clean them and install the gator dust. A pressure washer greatly reduces the time and labor to remove the existing medium. In this case, it's fine gravel. Proper work attire is recommended as the loose material will fly everywhere, so protect your eyes and skin. Notice how easily and quickly the pressure washer removes the material. All the jointing material is removed down to the bedding sand, but care is taken not to disturb the bedding sand. Now the pressure washer is used almost like a broom to re remove the material from the surface of the stone. A little further cleanup, and we're going to have to wait for the material for the stones to dry. It's important not to install gator dust on a damp or humid surface, as it will stick and will be very difficult to remove from the stones. Broom the gator dust into the joints, making sure to fill the joints completely. Then tamper the stones with a rubber hammer. A shock hammer works well. This will ensure that there are no air pockets in the gator dust. Air pockets would reduce the strength and performance. Gator dust should be installed about an eighth to a quarter of an inch lower than the surface of the stones. This will allow for expansion of the gator dust and a place for the water to go. Brush off all the, the powder possible, then using a leaf blower, gently remove any f remaining fine powder. The misting is done in three steps. First, using a fine mist setting similar to that of a watering can, moisten the joints. The idea is to first just dampen the gator dust. Over watering on the first pass is not good, it will reduce the compaction of the material. Wait a few minutes and repeat the misting a second time. On the third pass, using the same gentle spray, you can use more water. Take care not to overwater. When you notice the water is no longer being absorbed into the joint, you must stop. Overwatering will reduce the strength of the gator dust joint. Now would be a good time to sit back in one of those patio chairs and enjoy the fruits of your labor and the beauty of the scenery. As you can see from this video, it isn't very hard to do. Basically, if you can push a broom and water flowers, you too can produce the same results as you've seen here in this video. Good luck, and what's keeping you from getting started?